Many were surprised by my previous article about the Vikings' influence in Tamil regions, as most people typically link Kipling's poetry and the grandeur of the British Raj to European imperialism in South Asia. In contrast, very few are familiar with the history of the former French territories in Indian subcontinent, which were under the peaceful colonial rule of Pondicherry until they were handed back to India in 1954. France, once a prominent colonial force, had a lasting influence on the culture and history of the Indian subcontinent. Beginning with their initial trading post in the subcontinent during the 17th century, the French steadily grew their power and founded several colonies, with Pondicherry being the most notable. Situated on the Coromandel Coast or the Curry Zone of South India, Pondicherry thrived as a vibrant center of trade and business, drawing in merchants and settlers from various corners of the globe. Embark on a culinary journey through time as we explore the intriguing fusion of French and Tamil culinary traditions, a delightful intersection that has left an indelible mark on the beloved Tamil curry. While historical narratives often focus on political and economic aspects, the culinary legacy forged during the French presence in the Tamil area offers a mouth-watering tale of cultural exchange. Historical Background of the French Colonization in the Tamil Area in a narrative often dominated by Kipling's poetry and the British Raj, the former French Indian territories present a lesser-known chapter. Under the colonial rule of Pondicherry until 1954, these territories bore witness to a unique blend of French and Tamil influences. In 1644, King Louis XIV sanctioned the Compagnie des Indes, France's counterpart to the British East India Company. By 1674, the French had acquired the Putusri region, laying the foundation for Pondicherry. This strategic move marked the beginning of a lasting French influence on the Coromandel Coast, renowned as the Curry Zone of South Indian subcontinent. French Colonization, Culinary Intersection in the Tamil Area The French colonization of the Tamil area can be traced back to the 17th century when the French East India Company sought to expand its influence in the Indian subcontinent. Trading posts and forts dotted the southeastern coast, leading to a steady growth of French power in present-day Tamil Nadu and Puducherry. The French were drawn to the Tamil area for its strategic location, rich natural resources, and flourishing trade, especially in textiles and spices. This marked the genesis of a fascinating chapter in colonial history, with the French not only shaping the region politically but also leaving an indelible mark on its culinary landscape. Culinary fusion in the Tamil area The French influence on Tamil curry is most evident in the fusion of culinary techniques and ingredients. This amalgamation gave rise to a unique culinary tradition known as French Tamil cuisine. Dishes like Pondicherry fish curry and French-inspired pastries gained popularity, reflecting the harmonious blending of French and Tamil gastronomy. This delightful fusion created a new palette of flavors that continues to enchant food enthusiasts. Architects of Fusion, French and Tamil Culinary Techniques The impact of French culinary techniques on Tamil curry is apparent in the region's unique dishes. Pondicherry-style French bread, French-inspired seafood delicacies, and fusion desserts showcase the creative amalgamation that emerged during the colonial period. The French penchant for grandeur and ornate detailing in architecture translated into the culinary realm, elevating Tamil dishes to new heights. Lingering traces in Tamil curry's vocabulary. Beyond flavors, the French language also found its way into Tamil curry's vocabulary. Certain Tamil dialects in the region bear traces of linguistic influences from French, adding an extra layer of cultural richness to the culinary tapestry. The Vietnam Connection The French impact on the Tamil area extended beyond the shores of Coromandel or Curry Zone. Tamil traders, soldiers, and settlers traveled to Indochina, where the French had colonies in Laos, Vietnam, and Cambodia. This led to cultural exchanges, including culinary influences. Today, when savoring Vietnamese curry, one can appreciate the historical connection between Tamil curry and Vietnam, forged during the French colonial period. Dissemination of Tamil curry During the 100 years that France ruled Mauritius, from 1710 to 1810, they relocated Tamil settlers from Puducherry to Mauritius. The neighboring Reunion Islands, which are still governed by France, exhibit the same pattern. Thus, like the British, the French were also involved in the process of relocating Tamils to different parts of the world. The French and British, in contrast to the Portuguese and Dutch, achieved this by relocating Tamils to their other colonies, which led to the spread of curry to these territories. Legacy in every bite Despite the decline of the French colony, the legacy of their influence on Tamil curry remains alive and flavorful. 
The culinary fusion born from this historical intersection continues to tantalize taste buds, reminding us that the richness of cultural exchange extends to the plate. Conclusion, savoring centuries of fusion. In conclusion, the French didn't just leave architectural marvels, they infused the very essence of Tamil curry with a French flair, creating a culinary legacy that transcends time and borders. As we indulge in the diverse flavors of Tamil curry, let's savor not just the spices but also the centuries-old story of fusion that makes each bite a celebration of history and cultural vibrancy.